Hello, my name is Joe, and welcome to a very short edition of Joe's Super Fantabulous PC Gaming Channel, where I'm here in Elder Scrolls Online. And, let's see, apparently we have something special that came out today, and I, I completely missed the notice, if, if there was one. <laughs> so, maybe I'm not the only one who was caught off guard by this, so I thought I'd go ahead and share it with all of you. Currently, probably in celebration uh, of the upcoming release of the next chapter, it's time for an ESO Plus free trial for starting today, for one week, to be able to uh, try out the benefits. So I think we have to go down here and say, yeah, we want the free trial. All right. Ta-da. So we drink from the Golden Goblet. And as you can see, under my active effects now is ESO Plus member, even though I haven't spent any uh, money to become a, a member. So, let's see. There are areas that she didn't have access to before, like, oh, Southern Elsewhere. Aha! This was uh, grayed out for her earlier. I guess I should have shown it before I, I drank from the Golden Goblet, but trust me, uh, she didn't have access uh, to this DLC because it's not purchased. But, temporarily, it's open. So, while this uh, free trial is in effect, Hmm. It's time for a Sky Shard Bonanza. And run around and grab as many Sky Shards as possible and and see what kind of uh, interesting adventures we can have. Um, as a matter of fact, here, let's see if we look under... Oh, what is it? DLCs. Yeah, you can see which ones uh, are not purchased. So, I did pick her up the uh, four DLC Mega Pack for her, and which came with the Dark Brotherhood. But notice these other ones, which are like Harrowstorm, um, Scalebreaker, the Clockwork City. Oh yeah, she hasn't been able to go to the Clockwork City. Well, now she can. Oh, of course you have to do the little intro, I believe, in order to, to reach there, but let's see. Uh... Oh, no, I guess I can just travel directly. And... <laughs> So the good thing is that the craft bag, the extra bank space, being able to uh, dye costumes, all of this is available at least for one week for free. And knowing ESO, uh, they're usually pretty good guys. Uh, I'm hopeful that uh, at the end of the trial period all the sky shards that I discovered don't go away. <laughs> I think you just lose access to the areas, but they'll let you keep the experience and the things that you discovered. Um, or drops that you picked up along the way, so ah, let, let's have a whole week-long bit of fun in ESO. So I wish you luck if you have uh, never uh, signed up for the ESO Plus. I actually have two accounts. I have one that I've signed up for ESO Plus on, and the other one, this is my, you know, quote-unquote free account. I mean, it, it's a buy-to-play game. You know, I had to pay $10 to get the account, but other than that... Um, I generally don't spend any money on it, although eh, lately they got me with one of their sales, and I, I couldn't resist. I wanted to get the, the Dark Brotherhood DLC from, from my little Khajiit here so she can go on a murder spree, but um, <laughs> other than that, I, I don't really spend anything on this account, so it'll be nice to take advantage of these features for eh, at least a week. I hope that uh, this was helpful to you, and if you've ever wanted to try ESO Plus and see whether or not it's worth it to you, give it a try. It's available for free. See you next time.